Libra, this is Nikki. I hope that everybody is doing well. I came to bring you guys your energy for today. Listen, Libra, we got wedding here, okay? And we got mystery surrounding this wedding, okay? Um, you know, this could be a marriage. Um, this could be a forever union. Um, you know, this could be... Um, hold on, let me look at this card. Somebody could feel like they're the one here, okay? This could be a civil union. This could be some type of union, okay? It doesn't necessarily have to be wedding, okay? But some type of higher connection, okay? But see, the problem here is that there's a mystery surrounding this here union, this here marriage, this here um, person that could possibly be the one, okay? There's somebody that um, is maybe a little confused about this individual. Um, th there's an unknown that's going on. This person may be a little eccentric, okay? Maybe really not like... Mm -hmm. Love you too. There may not, they may be a little bit different, okay? Um, their personality, you know, the way they dress, the way they look, okay? Um, that could be uh, something too there, okay? Nonetheless, confusing, okay? Confusing and, and maybe even an illusion, all right? We got the Empress on the board. We got Six of Cups. We got Ace of Wands and we got the Lovers. The Lovers is something that I'm concerned with. We haven't con con um, clarified that. Um, the Ace of Wands is something that I'm also concerned with because I haven't clarified that. Six of Cups, I'm definitely concerned with, okay? Um, and the reason being is because a Six of Cups could be ending. This could be somebody who you knew from your childhood, okay? But what I'm going to do, though, Libra, is because there are so many different Libras going through so diff so many different things at this, point in the time, at, at this point in time that really, to be honest with you, I just want to throw some words at, at you, okay? Now, who I see on the board so far is I see um, Leo, Sagittarius, Aries. I see Gemini, and I see Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn, okay? And that is before we even clarified, you guys. Okay, so I'm going to throw some words at you because you guys are going through different things at different times right now. And, you know, y'all take what fits, okay? These are puzzle pieces, y'all, okay? So we got somebody here that's stable. We got somebody here that enjoys luxury. We got somebody here that is very beautiful, okay? We got someone that is very creative. We got somebody who's very fertile, okay? This person could be pregnant, you guys. This person could be pregnant when you met them. You could have got somebody pregnant, or they could have just had a baby, or they're just simply, a, a, you know, children, baby, kids up and around them, or... Um, somebody that you know, like a family member or friend could be pregnant, okay? This person believes in abundance, okay? Um, I would not necessarily call this person a gold digger. I would call this person a person that gets it from the ground up and wants a better life for themselves, okay? This person does definitely believe in love. This person, like I said, beauty and glamour go hand in hand with this individual, okay? This person is nurturing, okay? Six of Cups. This could have been a childhood friendship or a friendship of some type of sorts, okay? You could have known this person from your childhood. You could each, each you can actually, really, this could be an ex situation that you just can't get over, okay? It could be past memories, you know, with this situation. This could be a second time around, okay? Um, maybe somebody got a light bulb and said, you know what, with all these past memories I got of this person, you know, I'm not really willing to let them go. I'm really ready to level up our commitment. You see what I'm saying? Um, but there's an innocence around this energy. Okay. Um, there's joy around this energy. There is a slight bit of naivety, um, in this energy. However, there is a strong bond. Okay. Um, this could also speak of mending old relationships. Remember I told you that this could be a second time around. Okay, so now we got the Ace of Wands, which to me, you guys already know how I feel. That's a hoe, okay? But it doesn't necessarily have to be a hoe, okay? It could be somebody who believes in new beginnings, okay? This could be a second time around with somebody who you didn't think that was very important to you at one particular time. And after somebody left somebody, somebody started realizing that, you know what, this really is the one, okay? Okay um accepting the challenge okay accepting the challenge and the fact that this person is mysterious accepting the challenge is the fact that there are some things that you do not know about this person accepting the fact that there is illusions and sometimes confusion going on around this person okay um ace of wands can also speak of money all right which really goes hand in hand with the empress all right and also birth announcements okay um, growth, action, inspiration, good news, okay, coming, okay, and that could be the wedding, all right, and what it feels like already before I even get to the lovers 
is it just feels like somebody was with somebody and because there was so much mystery surrounding this individual that somebody decided to jump ship, okay? But when they fucked around and jumped ship, they realized that this person meant more to them than what they thought, okay? And they went back in, okay? That's what it feels like, all right? So with the lover's card, you guys got to always remember that the lover's has everything to do with choices, you guys. It has everything to do with there's a very strong bond, a very strong um, chemistry there. Um, however, it is a card of choices, all right? Um, this is not, uh, you know, the four of wands. This is not the two of cups, okay? This is, uh, re this, this has everything to do with Adam and Eve, okay? If y'all know anything about the Bible, you know about Adam and Eve, okay? Um, but you also know that there's no Adam and no Eve without no snake, okay? So what the lover's card represents that, all right? So either we have a situation to where we are choosing this lover's or we're choosing this snake in, in the midst of our love, okay? Which is temptation, okay? Regardless to what that temptation is, a lot of times it be third parties. I'm just going to tell you, okay? But anyway, that doesn't necessarily have to be this case. Let me throw some words at you. Unity, love, soulmates, morals, choices, partnership, kindred spirits, and strong bonds. Okay, this is what you're working with here, okay? It's what you're working with. You're working with somebody who wants to take this thing to either a marriage, a forever, <laughs> a forever um, situation, okay? Or um, a higher union, higher commitment, okay? However, like I said, mystery is a problem because somebody is confused here, all right? Somebody is like not really knowing here, okay? We got a boss on the table, okay? We got somebody who is not a ruler. We got somebody who is the ruler, okay? So this is a feminine energy, okay, you guys? So with this feminine energy being an empress, an empress is going to be what an empress is, and that is a shot caller, okay? So that right there may be um, sort of an enigma to some people, okay? Especially if I'm talking to a dude, okay? Because we have a very strong-willed feminine energy here, who, um, you know, they know what they want. This is just who they are, okay? This is not like, okay, well, they can change. You see what I'm saying? No, they're strong-willed. And maybe that is the reason why there was an ex situation at one particular time or a back, a, you know, a backing up of, all right? This strong-willed individual, uh, Libra, um, is a nurturer, okay? This is what she does. She goes and gets it. She's about her money. She's about her home life. She's about what she looks like. She's about her feeling good on the inside, okay? Um, like I said, this is a ruler. This is not the ruler, okay? This is not a punk here, okay? And so if you have two alphas here, like if I had the emperor here, that would definitely be a counterpart, but the emperor is more secure in his empress, okay? If I got a king here, the king would feel like the empress is really running the show, all right? They're not secure enough to deal with this empress energy, all right? So if that's the case and if that comes up, we will, we will discuss that, okay? However, I believe because of a love that was taking place in this enigma that um, stigmatizes this empress energy, okay? No, Lead you guys in a six of cups, okay? Which is a breakup, basically, okay? Or falling back of. However, the sex is very good with this individual. And also somebody somewhere along the line said that they're willing to accept this challenge, okay? Um, and then you, cause you guys got the lover's card. Okay. So let's go ahead and start clarifying Libra. But before I do, I want to thank my new subscribers, you guys. Thank you so much for subscribing to the channel. I really appreciate you and love you dearly. Okay. Um, listen, um, you know, if you guys have not subscribed to the channel, please accept my invitation to subscribe. There are so many incentives that are going on right now. Okay. Um, if you go in the description box and you look at number three, there you guys will find what I'm giving away, okay? The only thing that I ask is that you be a verified subscriber and um, that you comment below what you want, okay? Um, I do have tarot readers that are um, uh, subscribed to the channel. Tarot readers, tarot cards are what I'm giving away as well, as well as oracle cards. You know, that's our junk. So if you are a tarot reader and you are subscribed to the channel, say you want some tarot cards. That's cool, okay? No post is necessary. So with that being said, let's go ahead and get it. Oh, also there are free reads are gi given away too. And also for every 100 new subscribers, there will be um, somebody also chosen to get a free read, okay? So let's get busy, y'all. Y'all. Okay. 
This is the second time around, okay? You got the Ace of Cups right here. This is love. Somebody loves somebody, okay? Somebody abundant as hell, okay? Empress ain't broke, y'all. We got a king right here. Leo Sagittarius Aries. Remember I told you? There we go, another king. Virgo towards Capricorn. Remember I told you, okay? Anytime we got an empress on this board and we got anything less than an empress, okay? You need to understand this is a boss chick, okay? This is a divine feminine, all right? This is a boss. This is a shot caller right here, okay? This is what is in their DNA, okay? And I truly believe they got something to do with this mystery, this enigma, enigma surrounding um, the stigmatism of this divine female, okay? But it looks to me like, Holy Spirit, tell me about this wedding and this mystery for your um, sons and your daughters. It's a strong real female that somebody is definitely looking at and definitely want to take a risk to, okay? And that has everything to do with the Ace of Wands. And on top of that, somebody is very sexually attracted to this person. They're like, you know what? Uh, I just, you know, I got full optimism and jumping in on this because... To be, yeah, here we go. Didn't I tell you that this is not a broke female? This person has not only got money, this person come from money, okay? And we ain't talking about no little bitty money, all right, y'all? We talking about some serious ass money. We talking about some some generational wealth, okay? Is what we saying and what I'm talking about. Husband, tell me about this mystery, please, for your sons and your daughters. Mystery. Five of Cups, okay? This is the reason why y'all broke up, okay? Somebody is looking. Let me tell you about this Five of Cups, y'all. See this person right here? Okay, they got two cups. Hold on, how many in this deck? One, two, three, four. Okay, so they got one cup that they, that they got in their hand, okay? Which is all good, okay? Cups is love. It's emotions, okay? They got four on the ground, okay? They're paying more attention to what they lost than what they have in their hand, okay? And this is the reason why the Six of Cups is here. This is the reason why the Ace of Wands is here. And this is the reason why the Lovers is here. Because when somebody left somebody regarding this mystery, regarding this Empress, okay? What happened was, is they felt like they was, you know, I don't know, you know, I can't take this shit no more, okay? But what ended up happening was, is they started looking around. You see how this person is looking around? And it ain't nothing better than what was in their face. And so now they want to come back. Holy Spirit, tell me more about this Five of Cups. I guarantee you that's what it is. Because I can feel it. Right. See? Nine of Swords. Tripping. What did I do? Why did I walk away? What, 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 what is it that I could not have given? What is it that I could have sacrificed? What is it that I could have made stuff go better? Because this person is abundant. Because this person is glamorous. Because this person is a fucking boss. So what did I do? I left. And then when I left, now I'm in a spot, a nine of swords. I can't sleep at night. This shit is fucking with me. And what's even more so fucking with this person is, see how they sit in the bed? What's fucking with them is who the hell else is appreciating this fucking empress? Is what's going on, okay? Yeah, they fixing to do something about that. That's why you got wedding up here, okay? And that's why you got the lovers in, in, in the god dang old Ace of Wands. Holy Spirit, tell me one more. Yeah. It's the Empress right here. Y'all, don't just walk away from no damn Empress. You know how many Empresses out here in this world? Very few, okay? Very few. Right, see? Now somebody want to work hard. Somebody want to master this empress. Somebody want to say, okay, you know what? Fuck it. Let me learn her. Okay, you got the ace of pentacles. Let me learn this individual right here. Let me get on my job. Okay, ace of pentacles is mastering something. That's upping their game. That is coming. That is that is going from average and mediocre to greatness. Okay, I need to up my shit in order to deal with this individual. You see what I'm saying? Holy Spirit, talk about the empress. What is she doing? Because, you know, obviously this Empress right here, you know, if you six of cups, this person, I mean, I'm just saying. Yeah, see, and only on top of that, you guys, this is an older woman. And on top of that, this this person got Claire's. This person is gifted. This is high priestess, y'all. This is sacred knowledge. 
So not only is this a boss, okay, they got hella money and come from money, this person is gifted, okay? Holy Spirit, what is our rippers doing? Yeah, you don't, you don't just, you know, you don't, you don't just. This empress is like, you know what? Somebody has wasted my fucking time, okay? This empress is no longer interested. This empress is either bored, okay? Feel like somebody wasted their time or taken for granted. That is what this empress is thinking here with this high priestess, okay? Yeah, so that's why it's a mystery regarding around a, a higher connection, a wedding, okay? Your problem is going to be with your, with this empress. Yeah, because she, you got courthouse here, okay? This is judgment. This this is karma. This is, you know, uh, making a decision, all right? A fair decision, all right? And regardless to what happened in y'all, I mean, whatever happened in y'all relationship, Libra, it got this empress feeling First of all, she already fucking knows. That's number one. You got the high priestess there. This is an older woman we're talking about, okay? But whatever she knows, okay, whatever she has gotten an idea of is that somebody is taking her for granted. Somebody did not see her worth, okay? And now we got courthouse on the board, all right? Now, I don't know if she put a restraining order on your ass. I don't know, okay? He, she, I don't know, okay? But courthouse is here. Tell me about the Six of Cups. Okay, somebody willing to do some tricky ass shit to get back with Empress, okay? We got the Magician on the board, okay? That means they're willing to pull out every stop, okay? With the Magician, we got all the suits, okay? We got the cups, we got the wands, we got the swords, okay? We got the pinnacles. That means that they're willing to spend money, they're willing to talk, they're willing to do any type of action, they're willing to show love in order to get back this individual, okay? They're willing to do, and they will. They'll lie and manipulate too. Give me more, Holy Spirit. One of six cups. Somebody energy, y'all. Yeah, but they're going to get her. Okay, they got victory in it. It's Empress loves. One thing about Empress, Empress is loyal, okay? But you're going to have to work. As you see, the magician is working, okay? And they pulling out everything in the toolbox to get this bug back. And I don't blame you, okay? Because shit, that's the goddamn only person we talking about. Ace of Wands, sex is good with this person, okay? Holy Spirit, your sons, your daughters. Yeah, somebody's walking in the direction of something. Somebody fucked up. Somebody fucked up this empress. But they're getting them back though, okay? Holy Spirit, what is this? Yeah, and they on the way. Look, when it comes down to this Ace of Wands, this new beginning, the second time around, this accepting this challenge, not only are they walking in the direction of the Empress, okay? They got the chariot. So they ain't walking, they driving, all right? And you need to understand about this here chariot. It's the Emperor that drives the chariot. This is a very entitled person. This is a very determined person, okay, that drives this here chariot. That means that somebody's mind is made the fuck up, okay? That's what that means, okay? Holy Spirit, tell me more. They're on their way. This lover's card right here that we're going to, in just one second, is going to tell me why. They thought about it, y'all. Whoever's on the way to this empress, they sat up there and they retreated. They thought about it, okay? Before they decided to God dang on take a leap of faith. A tower hit, okay? They willing to put their friends and family in it to get you to get to get whoever back. This is you. If you the Empress, I mean you a Libra, okay. But if you taking upon Empress energy, listen, they willing to even put their friends and family in on this shit. Yeah, and see when they put their family friends in it, it's gonna be like they don't know shit. They know the whole goddamn old story, y'all. But they gonna sit up here and pretend like they don't know shit, okay? In order to get information up out of whoever this Empress is, okay. Yeah, this person will go there, okay? If they do not get this Empress back, this person will lie, steal, kill, and cheat, okay? They will manipulate. They will put their friends and family in it. 
and they will do whatever it takes. They're going to end up going to jail is what's going to end up happening if the tempers don't want them. Okay? So here we go with the Virgo Taurus Capricorn again. Okay? You could have got somebody pregnant. <laughs> Excuse me, y'all. You could have got somebody pregnant. Somebody could be pregnant. Could be a pregnancy up and around you, just like the Empress, okay? But the Empress and the Queen of Pentacles is the same person, okay? And really, to be honest with you, I can say this. I can say that, you know, because the the, the Queen of Pentacles came out, um, but the Empress is in the main energy, it almost is like what somebody is trying to do is soften this empress up, okay? So that this, even though she's still a queen here, okay? She ain't never going to be a page. Even though she's still a queen, she will come down up off of her throne. She'll scoot to the edge of her throne, y'all. She'll scoot to the edge of her throne, okay? And we'll take upon this queen energy, okay? But that's only because she's gotten to. That's only because you done told her what... You know, um, she won't hear you see what I'm saying, and that type of shit. And you know, you know, what is what 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 is she doing, Holy Spirit? This person is not from where you're from. This person is at a distance. Could have been an online situation. Okay, could have been a baby mama, baby daddy involved. Okay, you guys may have two different backgrounds. Conversation is not good. Okay, this person does not like that. Okay, this person is being very turned off. Okay, buy this. Holy Spirit, give me more about this, the queen of, yeah, and she's getting to the, she's getting to information, y'all. She's getting to some information. Okay, her buddies is here with her. Okay, we got queen of swords and we got queen of wands here. Okay, that is getting to the truth of the matter. Somebody is sexy, vivacious. And somebody is cutthroat. Somebody's fair but cutthroat, okay? What is Queen of Wands, Queen of Swords doing, Holy Spirit? It's a Libra, Gemini, and Aquarius. Ready to fight. Ready to fight, okay? Ready to fight. Like, no, nah, I'm not coming I'm not coming up off my throne for you. I'm not, you gonna respect me. You, you gonna do the shit that you, you know, this is what that is. Give me Queen of Wands, Holy Spirit. Now, this is another version because this person right here is either a Leo, Sagittarius, Aries, but this person is very good looking. This person is very sexy, vivacious, social butterfly. Um, this person can be a witch. Okay, and listen, the cycle is changing with this individual. This Sagittarius Leo Aries, it's, the cycle is changing. There could be travel involved there as well, okay? Queen of Swords is finding out some information that's going to cause some shit, okay? Give me, give me some more. Somebody going to put somebody's hands on somebody here. Nonetheless, they're still thinking. So it's a fight that ensued. It's a fight that ensued. Between you and somebody else, Virgo Taurus Capricorn, Libra Gemini Aquarius, Leo Sagittarius Aries, there's a fight that cons that's consumed, okay? But even though the fight consumed, it happened, somebody is still thinking, okay? They're thinking about this union, all right? They're thinking about, you know what, is it, is, should I be stay here? Or, you know, hey, I got a bright horizon in front of me. Yeah, and there we go with Virgo. They really are going in. They're really thinking, you know, what is my next move? You know what I'm saying? I see that this person want me back, but do I really want them back? You see what I'm saying? This person was a hoe at one particular time, or like I said, this is the Ace of Wands. It could be that somebody wants a new beginning, okay, with this here uh, Virgo towards Capricorn, okay? Yeah, and somebody is juggling. Somebody's juggling thoughts, okay? Or they're juggling this uh, Leo Sagittarius Aries one. Cycle is going to change. Holy Spirit, tell me more about this. There's love here, okay? But we got a Cancer Pisces Scorpio on the board, too. And these are all coming up as queens, okay? Give me more, Holy Spirit. Yeah, somebody who loves somebody is... You got Ten of Cups with somebody who loves somebody here. That's where the cycle is going to change, Okay? Give me more. This person that loves and wants a family, okay? This is the reason why wedding came up, okay? Yeah, because wishes is granted. Somebody's comfortable. A shot has been called. A decision has been made, all right? Give me this lover's Holy Spirit. What's going on with this? Why, 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 why? Like I said, I feel like somebody just was insecure. Somebody found out some information regarding this bond, okay? 
something didn't sit right, apparently, with nosy ass page of swords. Give me more, Holy Spirit. Yeah, see the third party. That's what they found out. Okay? That's what affected the Empress. This is the reason why the Empress is not interested anymore. Okay? Or was not interested anymore. Give me more Holy Spirit on this third party. So the third party could have been the Cancer Pisces Scorpio, the um, Leo Sagittarius Aries, or the um, Libra Gemini Aquarius. Okay? But I got Virgo. I got the Empress back on the board. I got Virgo Taurus Capricorn back on the board when it got to do with this third party. So somebody had this 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 Empress in a third party. Okay, Holy Spirit, give me more. What is she doing about this? She might have started seeing someone else. She might have got dipped into her business. Okay, she might have decided to have many friends, but she sat back wounded and guarded nonetheless. Jail hospital was here. Give me more. This person is a giver. Some people look up to this person. Okay, give me more. They're, they're wounded, set back or guarded against somebody. Okay. But they're still giving and they're still giving themselves to other people. There's a Cancer Pisces Scorpio that is in this person's energy. That's coming up as a king. Give me more, Holy Spirit. What are they doing? Yeah, shit is going in a different direction. That's the Wheel of Fortune. It's, you know, that could spin right or left, y'all. Give me more. What is this, Holy Spirit? Somebody's undecided and somebody got a difficult decision to make when it comes down to this will of fortune. This will of fortune can say, I want you back. I want to go back to you or I want something different. Okay? And they're in the two of swords, but I see death. So it doesn't look like it. And it is because somebody hid some shit. Okay? This is the reason why the difficult decision needs to be made. Okay? Um... Because the moon is here, all right? And because this person does have a difficult decision to make and they don't know the whole story, it's like it's over. It's death to the situation, okay? Somebody done fucked with the Empress. That's, that's, I mean, that's just what it is, okay? And courthouse is on the board. That could be a restraining order, y'all. So let me get this, okay? This is an older woman. It's a Virgo Taurus Capricorn, okay? We got Libra on the board, okay? Um... We got somebody doing some real tricky shit in order to get this person back. We definitely do got a hole in the midst of all of this. So understand, this person did go inside, okay, and thought about it. They definitely did. I mean, you know, you got the two of swords, I mean, the two of wands with the hermit, okay? There was fighting here. After Queen of Swords found out some bullshit, this Libra, Gemini, Aquarius found out it could have been a friend, okay? She's a queen as well, all right? Um, somebody's not where for somebody is from. You guys might have their different backgrounds. Virgo Taurus Capricorn, very heavy. Somebody has uh, resulted in some type of, um, you know, manipulative ass behavior to get in touch with this person or to, um, be able to reconcile with this person. Okay. And they are on the way. They're not giving up easily. Okay. Shot has been called, wishes is granted. Somebody is going to be getting married. Cancer Pisces Scorpio is definitely involved, and there is a Sagittarius Leo that is involved in this. Pisces is involved in this. Scorpio is involved in this. Listen, let me say this before I end this reading, okay? You got the Queen of Cups to the King of Cups, okay? So if the love is there, love, cups are love, okay? If the love, the attention, the affection, and everything is there, this may be able to bring down this person's walls, okay? Let me just go ahead and say that, all right? Because it's the Empress has been fucked up. That's three times on the board, okay? Somebody was in the third party, Page of Swords found out about this, and they did snitch, okay? They let, they let, they let the Empress know what the fuck is going on, okay? This is what happened, okay? All right, so that is your reading. But it does look like somebody let somebody go here, and then they want somebody back. This is that simple. And they damn sure willing to take a leap of faith. This is that simple. They believe in this, this, this love, okay? 
So this is what I have for you, Libra. I hope that this was helpful. Um, I, I will see you guys soon. Um, I definitely will see you guys Friday with all 12 signs. So with that being said, I love you guys. Like, share, and subscribe.